Recently, there's been an uptick in crazy streamers that have just been going off the walls with pranking and all this kind of BS streaming, trying to get, you know, views, engagement for just stupid content. And recently, it's gotten to a point where it's getting a little bit dangerous legally and there could be extreme legal precautions. And you're not going to believe what happened today. After I opened up my feed and Twitter feed and Reddit feed, it's all over the place. Millions of views already, but it was just despicable. You got to check this out. So just to, you know, not draw unwanted engagement and clicks and views to this person, I'm going to blur out their name um, next to the logos down below in the video. And I'm not going to mention her at all in the articles that uh, show her name and stuff because I don't want to drag any attention whatsoever to her. Streamers dare a homeless woman to jump into a lake and then run away when she starts yelling for help. What is this? Oh, of course, look at that. It's kick. Why is that not surprising? I mean, literally, like, Kick has just been crazy lately. I, I, you know, I don't know, like, everybody who gets banned on Twitch or whatever has just goes to Kick because apparently it's, like, you know, more free over there. But I don't know how, like, there's been some shady shit on Kick recently and people just do not get banned for it. And, you know, there's no, rep there seems to be no legal re repercussions whatsoever for their actions on Kick. I don't know what's going on over there. But yeah, anyway, check this out, man. It's ridiculous. I can't believe this happened. Right? No. No. All right. I was, you know why I wasn't going to? Because my shoes, my feet were getting You should hot. just jump in right now. But I'm going to jump in with my shoes on. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Ready? Oh. Wait, what the fuck? Did you see her ass? What? So first off, I mean, what? Uh, uh, she just jumps in the water and all she cares about is if they caught her ass on camera. Like, that's the big, that's the big issue here. I don't think so. Oh, you I... You said it was okay. You said you wanted to swim. You told me to jump in. I didn't tell you to jump in. Yes, yeah, you did. Yes. She literally just told her to jump in like five seconds ago. What the fuck is she talking about? Like, literally. I was, you know why I wasn't going to? Because my shoes, my feet were getting You should high. just jump in right now. She just said it right there. Is this girl like, does she have like no brain cells? Thank you guys. We're gonna have you guys get off. Wait, who is that? The fuck is going on? <laughs> I don't even. I can't swim. I can only float. Oh, she might literally die. No, no stop. Seriously, literally. don't stop. Please, you're actually freaking me out. No, <laughs> please. Please, God. No, she's, she's floating. She's drowning. I'm gonna fucking kill her. She she's drowning. I like how she just like, like being super dramatic about the whole thing. Like she's literally can't, she can't swim. And she's like, oh my God. Oh, the, oh, oh, oh. And like, like she's literally drowning, like off to the side, uh, you know, where the camera's not showing and she's not doing anything about it. Like fucking jump in and save her or something or get some help or something instead of just crying, sitting there, crying there. Like a little baby, like what? What the? Like what the actual fuck? Oh, oh this is bad. <laughs> I like how the Twitch chat just says like call nine one one. OMG, she's drowning. Killed her. GG. Like with all the laughing emojis. Like what the fuck is wrong with this chat too? Like they're like ridiculous. They're not helping at all. We leave. Oh, oh this is uh, bad. <laughs> Dude, Natalie. Dude, I'm sorry, I didn't know. She said she's drowning. She said she's drowning. I think you literally just murdered the lady. No, I didn't. I swear. I think you literally no, I didn't. Let's go. Dude, she's drowning in the lake. And again, like, what the fuck is she actually doing? Like, I like how she's like, oh my god, I think I actually killed her. Let's just run away and not get help at all, okay? Like, what the actual fuck is happening? What what the fuck's wrong with this person? She's ridiculous. God, there's a fire truck. Nah, this is bad. Wait, this is really bad. So as you can see, the fire truck pulled up there and um, finally someone with some brain cells, unlike this stupid girl, Twitch or whatever, not Twitch, kick streamer, excuse me, Twitch. <laughs> yeah, uh, actually called like 911 and helped the person, which is great, great to hear. And FYI, uh, the lady was fine. Um, she's okay, so that's good. But still, this is ridiculous. Like, they're just like, they just ran away. Like, there has to be, like, wouldn't there be some like legal, like repercussions to this? Or there has to be, or, or a kick, there should be a, there, 
first of all, there should be a kick ban immediately, like a perma ban, okay? Not one of those 72 hour bullshit kicks, okay? And second of all, this could be like, like attempted, it wouldn't be an attempted murder, I get, I don't know, it'd be like attempted manslaughter or something like that, okay? Maybe attempted murder, but seriously, there has to be some kind of legal repercussions to this kind of stuff, you know? It's ridiculous that she cannot get away with this kind of stuff. So I actually just found a follow-up article uh, regarding the whole situation, and um, I'm just going to blur out her name here. So she responds to online backlash for not helping the woman she offered $20 to jump into the lake. So just for context, yes, she offered $20 to a, home, a homeless person to jump into a lake who cannot swim. So controversial kick streamer has ruffled a lot of feathers recently after she encouraged a woman to jump into the lake and then left the scene while she cried for help. The incident occurred on one of her most recent live streams and clips of her not stopping to help went viral on social media. The fact that the kick streamer didn't stop to help the woman garnered a lot of backlash. She recently defended herself in a reply on X where she where the clip has amassed millions of views. So there's millions of views on this clip so far, which is insane. So, I mean, there has to be some kind of legal reproductions. I mean, millions of people have seen this already. Somebody has to have uh, reported this to the police or something. So she says, the lady wanted to swim. They told me to leave and stop filming. That's why we left. And she got the help she needed and is fine. Stop dragging shit, Allah, whatever Allah is supposed to mean. But wh who told you to stop filming? What, what do you mean by they told you? Who told you to stop filming and who told you to leave, okay? Whoever, I, I need to know who that is, okay? Was that the police? No, probably not. It was probably your friends or something. But you can't just leave, okay? She's literally like saying like, help me, I'm drowning. You can't just leave, okay? That's ridiculous. So the controversial, tick, uh, the controversial kick streamer tried to backtrack her early statements claiming the woman had wanted to swim. Uh, in the end, she she and the others were seen leaving the premises after being told off by by the authorities. Okay, so yeah, so she tried to backtrack and she tried to dig herself out of the huge asshole she was already in and she was digging herself deeper into. Um, but yeah, so they claimed that she wanted to swim. That wasn't the case, okay? She wanted the $20 she was going to give if she swam in the water. And then she told her to jump in. So she jumped in, but then like, oh... She probably thought like, oh, she's going to get the $20 and they're going to help her, you know, if there's a problem. But no, they just, I don't even think they gave her the $20 either. Okay. They just, they just left and just left her to die basically. So that's, that's ridiculous. And I can't believe this is happening on like a lot of streaming platform, like streamer with the streamers lately. I shouldn't say a lot of streaming platforms, but you mostly kick. Okay. Kick has been known to have, you know, terrible well, I should say very, very, um, Kick has been known to be a very controversial platform recently. So this makes a lot of sense that this person would be a Kick streamer, okay? There have also been incidents where uh, a good video was done already on it, but um, some Kick streamer tried to get on Omi TV or Omegle and tried to, you know, get under er, underage girls to, um, like, flash flash them on the on stream, live stream, without them without them knowing. And uh, that's just ridiculous. It's ridiculous that that person did not get banned at all on kick and is not facing any repercussions whatsoever. I think they got like some kind of like 72 hour kick or some uh, kick, no pun intended, uh, kick uh, from kick. Um, but it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous what's happening recently in, you know, the streaming world. And, um, you know, I'm just starting out streaming and I'm trying to be very, you know, you know, I'm trying to be a genuine like gaming streamer and just you know, very down to earth kind of streaming. Okay. Just gameplay, watching videos, having fun with viewers. You know, I don't, you know, I, I would never like succumb or stoop to these people's level. Okay. This is ridiculous. Don't stoop to these kind of people's level. Okay. Anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys because I just saw it on my feed. It was like a day ago and it was ridiculous and disturbing and just disgusting in general. Do not support this person if you find who out who they are. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, see you later. Uh, bye.